The Maersk, Alabama sits in a Kenyan port four days after it was hijacked off the coast of Somalia. The U.S. flagship arrived Saturday night with the crew aboard and her captain still held hostage. No sleep for four days. Yes, last night. Feel good. FBI agents are interviewing crew members about how they fought off the pirates who boarded their ship. We got a lot of business to take care of this morning. And we all tie. We all tie. For you later. Meanwhile, U.S. warships and helicopters stalked a lifeboat like this one, holding ship captain Richard Phillips. Four armed pirates are aboard the lifeboat, which is out of fuel and drifting. A Pentagon spokesman said Saturday night that negotiations to free Phillips were continuing. The New York Times reports talks broke down. The paper quotes Somali officials as blaming U.S. insistence that the pirates must be arrested. Now that they're in port, the ship's crew members are describing the attack. They say Captain Phillips sacrificed himself for the sake of the crew. We take hostage the leader guy, the leader of them. He don't look like leader, he was a small guy like this, very skinny. And when he take him, he was very scared. Phillips jumped out of the lifeboat Friday and tried to swim for his freedom. Defense Department sources say he was recaptured when a pirate fired an automatic weapon at or near him. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.